you guys doing? I don't know. My arm still hurts. My shoulder hurts. But I have to try to try to put some patch on the roof or something. I'm gonna have to rent a ladder. If Workman's Comp wanted to come over and fucking do it, that'd be nice. That doesn't seem like they want to. And, you know, in reference to my mother and father's companies, and in reference to, you know, friends of Hollywood, people that was paid money to do things for me, my mother had paid people, like maintenance and things like that. None of them have ever showed up. None of them have ever done nothing for me. But, uh... Anyways, I have to bring a ladder, I guess. Hopefully I can do everything with one arm. But the point of information... <laughs> I gotta put it under the underlay of the front of the shingles on the front of the house, too. So if I can put a ladder up and then climb up there and lean up against the ladder and try to spackle it. Because there's a leak in there. But anyways, back to the point of my mother and... Uh, my mother and father's companies. I know my mother had it on record that said that if I ever had to do any maintenance, it was lawsuits against the government. There's all kinds of laws because my mother is a multi. My mother was a trillionaire, you know, and my father was a trillionaire. But the thing of it is, is I'm supposed to be at my mother and father's mansions, and people are blocking me. So in reference to the information. And, you know, in reference to females of Hollywood that are, that are on, they were under contract to date me, or they were supposed to be like, you know, girlfriend or something. You know, I have an injured shoulder and nobody has showed up. No female from Hollywood, no female that, that was interested or any, any female that was under contract, to, you know, because there's like celebrity relationships. You know, they haven't shown up. So, you know, in reference to, uh, and then people are blocking other girls from dating me. I don't understand. These people are playing their tricks. And the satellite man's still burning my teeth right now. They even got the Dodgeball movie on with Vince Vaughn. And, you know, Vince Vaughn's cool. I like a lot of his movies that he's in, you know. But anyways, uh, the satellite man's burning my teeth right here on this side. That's mutilation. Somebody needs to ask the governors and mayors in America and police chiefs if they think that is uh, mutilation. My teeth are documented. My teeth are real. This man that's been burning my teeth has been violating certified x-ray information of my face and teeth. That man is a terrorist. They are certified records of my identity. And this man had tried to call my teeth fake. This man tried to make up false arrest accusations. Why didn't you arrest the government man that fabricated that he arrested me for something? I've never been arrested for anything. Why has the government allowed this dirty cop or dirty government agent to make up fucking lies? It's attempted murder. All my time is accounted for. This man tried to make up false sightings, claiming he thought somebody was hanging out in some, some bad area where people did drugs or something. My mother even had it on record where I'm supposed to be at. And I'm the person that owns my mother and father's estates. I'm the person that has legal right to be at my mother and father's mansions over anybody else in the fucking world. So who are these people trying to play their power trip holding me hostage, blocking me from my mother and father's mansions. What race are they? What religion are they? They didn't build my mother and father's mansions. They're not corporate property. They're residential private property of my mother and father. And my mother and father owned the parent companies of the companies, which I am the owner of, because my parents gave me everything. Why isn't corporate law attorneys and other attorneys Asking these questions of these government people. Like, uh, you don't own it. It's not yours. You didn't build it. You don't own the deeds to it, government man. Why the hell do you think you can sit there and slander my character to try to rip me off? You have no legal right.
You're violating intellectual protection laws. You're violating beauty protection laws. I've been a supermodel my whole life. I've been an entertainer my whole life. I was born into the entertainment industry. I have seniority. My grandfathers even owned, uh, they even owned stages for performing arts, theaters, newspapers, TV stations, radio stations back in the day. There's historic seniority status there that I have that you don't have and nothing is for sale. I am the owner of my mother and father's theaters, newspapers, magazines, uh, TV stations and radio stations and properties and companies and accounts. And who are you? Who are you? You're a thief. You're a terrorist. You have absolutely no connection to any of it. And you won't ever. And the Royal Protocol is a prenup document that says nobody's entitled to none of it except for me. Ever. No matter what, never. It is a prenup document. Above the courts, above anybody. I can't give nothing away. I can't sign nothing away to nobody. And I can't sell none of the properties or companies to anybody. I'm the owner forever. And it says that in the Royal Protocol, it says that in business documents, treasury documents, Supreme Court documents. So who are you? You're trying to manipulate the laws. You're trying to you're trying to corrupt the system of business and laws in America with your illegal position in government. Government does not have a right trying to steal property or land or businesses or copyrights. And this satellite man has been damaging my teeth. Damaged my teeth because he wanted to make fake dentures for his people? My teeth are my ethnicity, not yours. My anatomy is my ethnicity, my DNA, not yours, government man. You don't have a right stealing my beauty or damaging my beauty because you wanted to make yourself popular by trying to copy my face or you wanted to copy my anatomy or you wanted to steal things from me. And you've been using government facilities for your crimes? You've been using government monies? That's illegal funding. You need to go to court for your crimes, government man. It's attempted murder every single fucking day. And these people need to get charged with seven deadly sins and fatal attraction crimes in every category. They need to get charged for fatal attraction crimes of beauty. Fatal attraction crimes of teeth. Fatal attraction crimes of skin and blood and sperm and DNA and physical body shapes. Then you get charged for fatal attraction of intellect crimes. These people trying to steal my accomplishments. These people trying to steal my family history. Those people need to get charged. Now, which uh, law enforcement agency is going to do something to arrest these people? And this man tried to make up false criminal accusations against me. And all my time is accounted for. Why aren't they having that man on television? Why isn't somebody interviewing that man? Why he made up these accusations? Why he accused me of being somebody else with a criminal record? My identity is copyrighted. My whole anatomy is copyrighted. And the government has not even paid me even one fucking red cent for the abuses that they have done to me. Them damaging my teeth. Those people need to get charged for their fucking crimes and they need to get, order those people in the court immediately. Hello, uh, Treasury Departments around the world and hello, uh, United Nations.